Rescue teams are searching for hundreds of people a day after an earthquake hit southwest China. Rescue teams are searching for hundreds of people left stranded or indeed feared missing a day after a strong earthquake hit southwest China. At least 66 people are now known to have died when the 6.8 magnitude quake struck Sichuan province. Millions of people in the region were already having to deal with a Covid-related lockdown. Here's the BBC's Azadeh Mashiri. This is what a 6.8 magnitude earthquake looks like. And this is what's left of the towns it hit in southwestern China's Sichuan province. Rescue teams have been deployed to find survivors. Some trapped under toppled buildings. Authorities say dozens have been killed and warned hundreds of people are still stranded or missing. We'll continue to seize every minute and second to rescue the injured and check the disaster situation. Carry out rescue work in a scientific and efficient way so as to ensure the injured people are transferred and treated as quickly as possible. For those still under a strict COVID lockdown, there was no escape from the buildings they've been confined to. And away from urban areas, landslides have destroyed roads and created several obstacles for rescue teams. It's made getting survivors to safety challenging. Teams have sometimes had to use makeshift bridges to carry people through. Police and relief teams have also set up tents and food supplies for anyone who's been displaced by the quake. Here a reporter asks whether the family in this tent has eaten anything. Yes, they say, some instant noodles. Meteorologists have now warned that they're expecting significant rain to follow, making rescue operations even more difficult. Azadeh Mashiri, BBC News.